I spent the last several years improving my habits and there is one simple idea that has allowed me to build any habit effortlessly. And what you're about to learn will help you avoid the number one mistake that stops people from developing good habits so that you can become the best version of yourself and not end up like Nevet over here. <clears throat> oh, hey, um, Cheetos? You see, Naved is much like you and I. He's got big ambitions. He really wants to get into the best shape of his life, read more books, and open up that restaurant for cats for some reason that I can't quite figure out. Well, it's actually a really profitable demographic, but a lot of people overlook- But he struggles to actually stick with his habits. You see, he starts off super motivated. He goes at it really well for about a week or so, but then shortly after gives up on all of them. That's funny. That never happened. But you see, Naved is actually falling into the trap that so many of us find ourselves in. And little does he know if he just made one very small change, everything would fall into place. Are you going to tell me what- and I'm going to tell you what that idea is, but in order to better understand it, I first want to talk to you about puzzles. Are you going to just keep cutting me off? Imagine I dump a bunch of puzzle pieces in front of you and I tell you to finish it. <laughs> so you start solving the puzzle. It's all going really well. You're making progress. You can kind of start to see an image. Things are really looking up, but then you start getting tired. You're hungry, your brain isn't working as well as it was before, and you just can't seem to get any pieces to fit together. Eventually, you're so frustrated that you decide to give up. You claim that puzzles are stupid anyways, and walk away. Unfortunately, every time you walk by that puzzle now, you feel like a piece of shit because you know you should try and solve it, but you just can't shake that feeling of frustration and pain that you were in while you were solving it, so you don't bother and the puzzle forever lives unsolved. However, imagine the same scenario, except this time I say, Just put two pieces together. Oh, that's, that's it? Yeah, that's really it. Oh, okay, yeah. If this was the case, you'd be much less overwhelmed and could definitely find two pieces that go together within a few minutes. You see, what ends up happening is that every time you put two pieces together, you feel good about yourself. And so you end up coming back day after day so that you continue to feel good about yourself. After a little while, you actually look forward to getting to solve the puzzle and you wanna spend more time solving the puzzle because you start to feel like a bit of a master puzzle solver. In just a matter of a few days, you've actually made more progress on the puzzle than the person who tried to solve it all in one day. You see, habits are no different. Often these big goals, running a marathon, eating healthy, learning to play the guitar, they can feel a lot like trying to solve an entire puzzle in one sitting. You may start off highly motivated, but as soon as things get hard, you stop and often never get back to it. Instead, you need to find a way to make your habits as simple as just putting two puzzle pieces together. That's where the two minute rule comes into play. The two minute rule is from the book Atomic Habits by James Clear. It states, when you start a new habit, it should take less than two minutes to do it. What you'll find is that any habit can actually be scaled down to a two minute version. The same way that solving an entire puzzle can be scaled down into putting two pieces together, reading more books can be scaled down to reading a single page. Finding your dream job can be scaled down to editing a single bullet point on your resume. Working out can be scaled down to doing a single push-up. Now, of course, the goal isn't to do a single push-up or read one page. No one would aspire to do that because everyone can do it, even Naved. Really? You think I, I could? Huh. The point of doing a single push-up is that you're going to feel good about the fact that you said you were going to do something and then you actually followed through and did it. And as a result, you're more likely to come back the next day and the next day after that to do it again. And if you do this enough days in a row, before you know it, you're actually going to identify yourself as somebody who actually exercises on a regular basis. And over time, you're actually going to want to exercise more. And for all of you out there that are saying that one push-up or one minute of meditation isn't going to do anything, well, do you know what's worse than just doing one push-up or one minute of meditation? Oh, uh, 
not having a successful social interaction in the last two years? What? No, no. It's two years? Well, yeah, 23 months and seven days. Oh my God. Well, no. What's worse than just doing one push up or one minute of meditation is doing zero of either of them. The whole point of the two minute rule is to help you get over the hardest part of starting any habit, which is starting the habit. If you have a really big goal in your life that you're trying to work towards and you're trying to implement the right habits to achieve it, but you're struggling to do so, well, ask yourself a really simple question, which is what does the two minute version of this habit look like? You really wanna drill down and make this habit as simple as possible. The goal here is to make the habit so easy that you would actually feel stupid doing it. Once you master this, all of your goals will be within reach in no time. <laughs> hey Devin, I found a piece of uh, Cheeto in my belly button. Should I, should I eat it? And if you don't wanna end up like Naved over here, there's actually a few habits that I've picked up in the last six months that have completely changed my life. I'll link the video right here. The best part is these habits are super small and if you actually implement them correctly, they could change your life forever.